Hi, I'm Cedric of Artings.com. We have today the 55-inch Samsung H6203 LED TV. This is the cheaper variant of the Samsung H6350. As we will see in this video, it has the same great picture quality. However, the build is cheaper and the software features are slower. We will also compare it in this video to the Vizio E-Series and the Sony W800B. To reduce the cost, Samsung didn't really bother with a better design. It does look like a cheaper TV. The stand doesn't swivel, the borders are wide, and the TV is very thick. It also only has two HDMI and two USB ports. The good news is that the picture quality isn't affected by the cost cutting. The blacks are still deep in a dark room. In fact, all of the TVs in this comparison have about the same great contrast ratio. The amount of reflections is average good for an LED. About the same as the H6350, the Vizio E-Series and the Sony W800B. It doesn't get very bright though, so it could be a problem if you have a lot of windows during the day. The Samsung H6350 is the brightest TV in this comparison. The motion blur is great. It looks almost exactly like the Samsung H6350, although the backlight is slightly less aggressive. The Vizio and Sony are also great. They all have about the same trail length. As for the input lag, no surprise here. Almost all Samsung TVs has this amount of lag under game mode. The Sony and Vizio have less input lag, so serious gamers will prefer them, but the difference is not really big. All these TVs have a VA-LCD panel. This means the colors are different at an angle. This isn't a use issue though, so don't worry about it unless you always sit at an angle. The black uniformity is really great, probably because the TV is really thick. Only the E-series in this comparison has clouding issues. The rest are great. The grey uniformity could be better. There is no darker spots, but there are some vertical bands. It was also present on the H6350, but to a lesser degree. Vizio is again the worst in this test. This TV has a smart interface, but it isn't a full version like other Samsung TVs. Only the Apps tab is there. Also, all software features feel a lot slower than on the H6350. So don't get this TV if you plan on using the smart features. The Samsung H6203 has the same great picture quality as the Pricer H6350. The only differences are the cheaper design and the slower smart features. If you don't care about that, save some money and go for this TV. The picture quality is great. The link to our full review is in the description of this video where you can find our complete test suite, compare this TV to others, and even see the price history of popular stores. 